actress Daphne Maxwell Reed is making her mother Rosalie's waffles. It's a creative way to repurpose an old crib and turn it into an activity table is Maria. My crib, Parker's crib's not old yet, but it's this not is a great old idea. Yet. I love this. No. It's a great idea. And well, it's Happy National Brothers Day, everybody. Oh, oh. It's National Brothers Day, and I happen to have two boys. I don't have brothers. Um, I am a sister. So no, <laughs> I, I have two boys. You can see here we have Grant and JJ. Aww. And I will tell you, just seeing the, even their relationship now, JJ just smiles when he Aww. sees Grant, and Grant is so great about being such a great big brother, and I just want them to have a relationship like what yeah. you boys have. Yeah. I will say, Kai and Avery, I, I just knew, look at they, oh my they don't DIY they together, <laughs> they play music together. That's so that's cool. And great, regardless, it's art, it's artistic. Exactly, yeah. that, that and I love that. I love so proud of them. And I want to, I'm, I'm proud of my babies, they're just so much I smaller. I just oh. hope my mom likes Metallica, because <laughs> that's what she's gonna hear when they Well, together. that's okay. And, you know, <laughs> so you have music. More songs. The boys. You have music in your house, and I don't have Metallica in mind. I have DIYs. <laughs> so that is what inspired me to create this lovely activity center. So when you you have your cribs and you don't know what to do with them mm -hmm. afterwards, this is a great idea to encourage the kids to play together. And so this is an actual crib that I made and, into an activity. It's well, phenomenal. let's take a look how you got yeah. started right on this because this has got a lot of work behind it. So this. you just need to take the uh, front part off of the crib. Uh -huh. Obviously, there's four sides to the crib. So this is just the front little gate area. And uh, it's uh, so fun when you actually move to the big kids, you know, the big kid bed. And then this is called a pipe strap. And this is what we do put on the side. Um, and you actually just screw it in. Uh, really okay. simple. And this is what's going to keep that front part up when it's, because, you know, you need the support from taking off the front. Oh, God. And then just painted it white. So it's That's it. That's it. And oh, then, because okay. I wanted to go with a nautical theme, so that's okay, why I thought the right. white was a really sure. great base. Okay, okay. but then you added it. all these accoutrements. I added fancy. Stuff. I added So stuff. how do we make the life preservers? Because those are really Aren't they really fun? So the life preservers are, uh, I wanted to make them sort of like vintage and customized. So these are actually just like the floral wreaths, like the styrofoam yeah. things you get at the craft supply store. And this is called Sell You Clay. You use there, right that. there. Sell You Clay. And then, um, so the reason I did this, and I've worked with Sell You Clay before. What is it? It's um, another form of clay. Uh, and so, clay. no, it's like basically like a paper mache. And so what you do is, the, it comes as like a powdered form. Yeah. And uh, it, you can really shape almost anything with it because it hardens up. Got so it. then you, it's the powder and then you add water to it. Mm -hmm. And you can see, you uh, do it until you get the consistency that you like. And then all you really need to do is on here, I would probably work in a covered, um, on a covered surface as well. Like you can see we have the craft paper down here, but you could do a wax paper. And then huh. you can do this all over the whole thing. Mold it all the way around. How long does it take it to get hard? It can, take, it can take up to 24 hours, depending on how much liquid. So after I put like the layer here, yeah. um, and then I would do dip my hand in the water, and then smooth, smooth it, it out. Smooth it out. Would yeah. you set it out in the sun to dry? Yes, would that that'd help? be great. Just to get the that water would be great. And would it, sure. Does this, when you pour it, does it get like all... <sighs> It goes all you know over the I mean. place. So, okay. It goes all over the place. It's non-toxic, but I, I would do it uh, outside. Okay. I would try And maybe me. wear a mask? You could. I okay. mean, yeah, you could. It's non-toxic, but you don't want to inhale any You're little right. particles Talk or anything anyway. Talk about sails that are floating over there. Oh, that's amazing. so cute. It makes this me want to sing, like, come sail away, but I won't. <laughs> oh, I will not, not do that like to you it. guys. So I will tell you, this is just a dowel here uh -huh. that... Uh, you can see actually the just zip tied in and also yeah. some a glue gun uh, mm -hmm. that we just did there. But you can use like a wood glue as well. And then this is just rope and this is a no sew situation we have over really? here. Yeah, you just oh. take the fabric, fold it over, and then use a glue gun oh. along here and then just wrap it around here with the glue gun. This is all some glueage happening here and some rope. All and right. that's and really it. And what about the other little we, things? We have to that steer are the ship, don't we? Oh yeah, so the steering wheel that we have right here is super cute, Mark. That's right in yeah. front of you. Oh, so <laughs> when you go, when you're getting this, this you're getting this like floral wreath here. These are just the floral uh, wreaths in the same area. It's just a flatter one, mm -hmm. and you, they come in different sizes. Uh, this is 18 inches, six inch, and then these are just little popsicle stick things. They come in different sizes. You could use paint stirrers as well, and then just glue them on. That's you can it. use and a wood glue. Extended, what a great you idea. Just cut it and yeah, so you just like exactly that. just and cut it and do that to have it so it's long enough. And, paint it. and, and paint you could blue. do a wood glue or you could use glue gun and then painted it and that's really it. And then covered it with uh, the paper right. for them so they can color on there. And, I love uh, that idea. This is such a great idea. It's, it's a perfect so little fun. desk. It's so but fun. But it encourages Maria. their inner creativity to It does. Come oh my goodness. Which is so important. And repurposing an old crib so you don't need to buy anything new. And you don't care if like they do color 
on it or anything like that. Right. So it allows some creative freedom. And you know it already fits in the space. Exactly. <laughs> that is perfect. I love this. I know I always say I love your last oh. DIY, but this is my favorite. I'll and take when it. they get tired, they can just take a nap right there. <laughs> Full instructions available by going to hallmarkchannel.com. It's true. They can. <laughs> you all stick around. Up next is Lawrence. Up next, I'm going to show my lovely ladies how to get some stylish soul with this summer's hottest sandals.